You are taking a live look at what is left of a historic DeKalb County building after an overnight fire. Firefighters were on the scene for five hours while they tried to control the flames. They didn't leave the scene until 1 a.m. Way 31 Sierra Phillips joins us live now after speaking with the owner about what's next. Sierra. I spoke with the woman who's been working with her family for the last four years to convert this property into a bed and breakfast. Let me move out of your way so you can see what's left of the 1850s home. She told me watching the property go from this to this is heartbreaking. Unreal. It, it didn't seem real, and, but devastating to know that it, it really was happening. That's what Rhonda Weathers, owner of the Weathers Place Bed and Breakfast, told me she felt as she saw her more than 150 year old building go up in flames. It's heartbreaking. It really is. Her family started working on the property in 2015. In that time, they converted it from a family home to a bed and breakfast. And this was a kitchen, and where the fireplace is was a dining room, and on the other side of the fireplace was a living room. Her daughter got married here in 2017. A It's a special place. Weathers told me she's not sure what they're going to do next. You never expect anything like this to happen. You know, it's been here for so many years. You just think it'll always be here. The fire started a little before 8.30 last night, and officials are still investigating the cause. Reporting live in DeKalb County, Sierra Phillips, Way 31 News. Thank you, Sierra. Authorities are investigating after one person was sent to the 